What's going on guys, Twin coming at you with another MLB The Show 19 video. Today we're trying to get to 9 wins, secure this diamond reward, and also reveal the 12 win diamond reward. And I just want to mention that we can either play 2, 3, or 4 games here in this video for you guys. So 2 if we just lose the first 2, 3 if we win the first 3, get to 9 and 0, stay undefeated, or 4 games if we win 3, but lose 1 at any point during those first few games. You know, we win 1, lose 1, and then win the next 2, something like that. So we're going to play anywhere from 2 to 4 games games here in this video so we're going for 124 or more likes on it subscribe if y'all are new on the road to 41,000 subscribers comment anything down below feel free to follow on any of those social medias if y'all want to sub to that fortnite channel in the description and thank you so much to our channel members for the extra support we're currently 6-0 with this team they've been doing pretty well i feel like i've been hitting really well recently in battle royale i'm hoping to keep that going and obviously continue to work on my pitching as we try to get win number seven right now we're playing the evo shield canes our opponent has Wow. Okay, uh, Joey Gallo, 87, Edwin, 99, Ty Cobb, Tim Anderson, 96, Jeff McNeil, Salvi, Gio Urshela, Nick Castellanos, Odrissimer, Despagne on the mound. We got Miguel Diaz on the mound. Away team looking for win number seven right here. I really want to stay undefeated, y'all. Our opponent has a great lineup. I'm going to have to be careful. Pedro Alvarez, pinch hitting, leading off the game. Deep fly to center. It's going to bounce and get over that wall. That's lead off ground rule double. Now we got to try to drive him in. Mike Piazza, man, I got a great pitch to hit. I think it should advance the runner. I'm pretty sure. I feel like this should get us to third, 46 speed. It looks like it's going to be closer than I want it to be. Whew, we're in there safely. Wow, that was a lot closer than I wanted it to be. I got a great pitch to hit, and I just missed it. Bring it up, Nico Goodrum, who kills righties. Looking to drive him in. A deep fly ball does just that. Nico Goodrum, center field. I think it's going to be caught. Pretty sure. Yeah, didn't quite have enough to get out of here, but we do take a lead. We're winning one to nothing. Will that lead hold? If I had to guess, if I were going to put money on it, I would say a one-run lead will not be enough for me. You never know, but based on my pitching, how far we are in this run, I would just assume not as Willie McCovey comes up to bat. Vladimir Guerrero leading off the top of the second. We had a 1-2-3 bottom of the first. I actually felt good on the mound. It's only three batters, so only three outs, only one half inning. So... I don't think I can say, like, yeah, I'm pitching well today because I just haven't pitched enough to actually tell. Vlad leading us off with a double. Eugenio Suarez looking beautiful up the play for me. That was a great swing, man. Wow. And we're trying to drive in this run. I got to extend the lead, I think, a little bit. Eugenio up the middle. Is that going to get through? No way. And advances the runner. Okay, if he was a little bit faster, maybe he would have been safe. But now we have one down, runner 90 feet away, just like in the first inning. If we can get a deep fly ball. We score that run. He's intentionally walking. I don't even know who was up. I actually don't remember who was up. Oh, Jonathan Scope. He's intentionally walking. Jonathan Scope. Now there's a double play in order. AJ Pollock coming up. 1-0 count to him. Anything but a double play here, please. And ball four. Four pitch walk to AJ Pollock. This is tough because Carson Smith is like the pitcher I'm most confident in in the bullpen. He's been my best pitcher in the bullpen. So I really don't want to take him out because he's only pitched to two batters. But... This is such a huge opportunity, man. Bases are loaded. I feel like a good offense can make up for a lack of pitching for me. So we're going to have Yoan Moncada pinch hit here. Yoan Moncada. Dang, man. I was hoping for a grand slam. It's going to score a run, though. The good news is we scored a run. I don't know if Carson Smith would have been able to do that right there. And with two down, two on, top of the second inning, winning by two. We have the top of our lineup, Pedro Alvarez, coming up to hit again. Our opponent brings in a lefty, but wait, Jake Diekman, you're in for a surprise. Now we got Miguel Sano ready to come in. Oh, no, I struck out. I'm not going to lie, man. Jake Diekman tripped me up there. I'm not used to facing him. I was not used to that motion at all. Tripped me up. At least we scored a run in the inning, but, man, I wasted a pinch hitter a little bit there. Mike Piazza, leadoff single, top of the third inning. I honestly am glad. So our opponent had Jake Diekman on the mound with Miguel Sano. I had trouble picking him up. I was having a really tough time seeing the ball out of his hands and our opponent to just start the third inning. And it makes sense with 99 Mike Piazza, right, to try to get that matchup going. But he brought in a righty, and I'm definitely happy about that. We had another one, two, three in the bottom of the second. I'm hoping the same for the bottom of the third. But just in case, I want to try to get some insurance runs here with one down. And ball four to Willie McCovey, a one-out walk, two on, one down for Vlad. He had a nice double earlier, looking to recreate that. Vlad on top of it, but through the hole, bases are going to be loaded. Only one down, man. I can't choke this opportunity. I have to score at least one, but I feel like I need to score more than one right here. 
No, 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 no. I didn't even score one. You're kidding me, man. Oh, I suck. Wow, did I seriously ground into a double play? One out, base is loaded, and that's what I do. I'm disappointed. No, dang. Okay, so one and two count. Guys, there's two down. We're one out away. We were one strike away from winning this game, and now the tying run, Joey Gallo's up to bat. Just like that. We were one strike away from winning, and then, and then now the tying run's up to bat. So uh, we're going to definitely do our best to not let Joey Gallo hit a home run. I'm scared to pitch to him, but our opponent has... Let me see. I'm pretty sure it's Edwin and then someone else. Yeah, they have Diamond Edwin, 99 Ty Cobb after this. So I'm picking my poison. We're going with Joey Gallo trying to finish this one off. And Joey Gallo Ooh, gave me a little bit of a scare, but the good news is we're holding on to win. We are now 7-0 with this team. Let's go try to get win number 8 right now yo you guys seriously just have no idea like how happy it makes me to receive messages like this fix nba 2k20 please shout out to you man i really do appreciate the love that's awesome thank you so much if you're watching this video hopefully you love seeing yourself in this video thank you so much again man it, it really does mean a lot so thank you thank you thank you we're playing the rock bottoms our opponent has miguel sano 99 lou Gehrig, jorge soler wow uh, 90, Jacoby Ellsbury, 82, Lordy's, 88, Luis Arias, Yasmani, Yuli, Danny Duffy on the mound. We got Zach Eflin on the mound. Our opponent has a great lineup, guys. Jorge Soler, Budget Beast, insane battle royale card. Just, I, I'm scared again. I know I probably shouldn't go into games scared, but I'm scared again. I've lost a lot of important games in this ballpark. Hoping that's not the case today. Mike Piazza into the outfield. We brought in Miguel Sano to pinch hit. And I flew out to right field. I tried to go Apo Taco on it. Not even close. And that's bringing up Nico Goodrum, who's good against righties, trying to come through. Nico Goodrum, come on, let's go. It's getting through the hole. I was so scared that was going to be a double play right there. Willie McCovey up the middle. Do I send the runner? I feel like I should not send the runner here. I think we would have been done. I'm just, oh wait, I don't know. Maybe not. I'm not sure. Either way, we have bases loaded, one down for Vlad, who was two for two last game. Looking to come through again here. No! Oh, no, Vlad! This is like the same... If I go home... Wait. Bro, we're gunned! That's why I didn't go home. I can't believe it. Base is loaded, and I don't even score a run with one down. I'm so mad right now, man. That could be the opportunity that loses me my flawless run. Because if you want to go 12-0, you can't show good opportunities like that, and that could very well be... The opportunity that loses me this game loses me my flawless run, man. I can't believe I didn't score there. Wow. Outside slider. Miguel Sano going the other way. He would have scored, I think. I don't know. <laughs> That's a leadoff triple. I I'm stupid. I don't know, man. Let's... Let's walk the runner so we have a double play in order. Let's do that, and let's somehow get out of the inning. I am very tempted to walk the bases loaded and try to get, like, a force play at home, but I think that's a little bit too risky here. I, I just, I don't know, man. This is a tough spot. Jorge Soler, no, that was the double play ball. There it was. We got the grounder. We got him on top of it with the sinker, but sending it through the hole, man. Shoot. Jacoby Ellsbury, another double play ball. Too fast, though. Yeah, way too fast. At least we got one. Guriel to the outfield. That's going to easily score a run, too. Maybe if it were Vlad in center, we'd get it in quick enough, but I doubt we do right here. Yeah, not even close. We're down 2 nothing. Dang, man. Now I really wish I would have scored in the top of the first inning. And 0-2 count. We run the slider in. I got to see where this one was because I felt like I was hitting my spot there, but I just want to see exactly where it was. Yeah, a little bit not as inside as I thought it was, and that extends the inning. Yasmani Grandal, warning track power, I think. Uh, Yasmani Grandal, two RBI double. We're down 4 nothing, guys. And we're escaping danger. We're getting escaping danger. No, we, we we blew it, man. We allowed four runs in the bottom of the first inning. Case closed. After one, it's 4 nothing. I hit pretty well in the top of the first, and we're going to try to get at least one of those runs back here. Jonathan Scope. There we go. That's going to be a one-out at least double. I hope we can get more 58 speed. I doubt we will. 
Yeah, Jonathan Scope, a one-out double. Scoring position, we have to drive him in here. I choked first inning. I can't choke second inning. AJ Pollock going to try to advance the runner. Never mind. Don't be a double play. It's not. That's good, but man. Now we're going to be pinch hitting for Carson Smith. Pedro Alvarez, come through, please. Pedro comes through, please. I'm going home again. I have to be safe this time. There we go. We're actually safe. We cut into the lead. That makes me happy. Now it's only a three-run deficit, which is a little bit more manageable, I guess, than a four-run one. And Miguel Sano makes it a one-run deficit. Let's go, baby. Yes, sir. Miguel Sano, no doubt about it. Wow, that's huge. Oh, my goodness. Mike Piazza. The tying runs now on first base with two down. Let's try to drive him in. Nico Goodrum batting right-handed comes through. However, lefty on the mound. That's bringing up lefty Willie McCovey here. And ball four to Willie McCovey. Two ounce bases are now loaded for Diamond Vlad. Wow. Vlad comes through in a big way. Let's go. That's going to drive in two, maybe three. Probably not three with 24 speed. Vlad coming through our two-out rally going strong. We take the lead here in the second inning. Wow. Hey, Eugenio Suarez, no doubt, three-run home run. Our lead's extended to four. Let's go. It is now an eight-run second inning, two-out rally. I don't even know how many runs we've scored with two outs now. Let's go. Miguel Sano, I'm not surprised. It was a 3-0 count, then a 3-1 count, and I just, I wanted, I didn't want to walk him. And he pretty much walked right there on first base, one down, 99 Lou Gehrig coming up. Lou Gehrig. Back-to-back -back singles, not good, man, not good. If we give up a home run, we're only losing, or only winning, sorry, we're only winning by one here, so we don't want to do that. Striking out Jorge Soler, wow. Whoo, big out number two. And Jacoby Ellsbury up the middle, probably going to score one. Yeah, that's scoring one, so we're only winning by three now, hoping this two-out rally doesn't keep going. And we're striking him out, escaping in the inning, on our way to the third, still winning by three. Let's try to get some more insurance runs, though. I still, like, am not feeling good. I'm still a little bit nervous about this game. Yoan Moncada pinch hitting, one out, pinch hit, base hit, single for Miguel Sano. I would not mind Miguel Sano coming up here to hit another home run. That'd be sick. And ball for to Miguel Sano, four pitch walk, two on, one down for Mike Piazza. No, I missed it. Oh, man, I got such a good pitch to hit, and I, I like, I felt, I literally felt myself drop the PCI there. I just felt the PCI on where it should have been, and then me just go, whoop. Oh, man, I'm disappointed in that. That was such a great pitch to hit. Nico Goodrum destroys righties. Will our opponent do anything? Doesn't look like it. Two on, on the corners, two down. Now base is loaded. After the intentional walk for Willie McCovey, I would not be surprised at all if he brought in the lefty here. And he does just that. It looks like A.J. Minter, four-seam cutter, change two-seam. And ball four to Willie McCovey. He walks home a run. Let's go, baby. Base is loaded for Vlad. No, I, cho I didn't choke it. Vlad comes through. We're going to try to score two. No! We would have been safe at third. What am I doing? I don't know, man. Don't talk to me, please. We don't want to talk about that. We're winning by five. We scored some runs. We're winning by five. I don't want to discuss that at all. With two down in the bottom of the third inning, Yuli Gurriel grounds out, and we're holding on to get win number eight. I'm not going to lie to you guys. After we went down, so we choked bases loaded one down, top of the first inning, didn't score a single run, and then we went down by four in the bottom of the first inning. I kind of lost faith in this game, man. I was like, well... That's an L. We're going to have to move on. I'm no longer flawless. But we held on. We battled back. And we won the game thanks to a huge eight run. Top of the second inning. We're now 8-0. and oh. What a coincidence. With this team, let's go try to get win number nine right now. Secure the diamond and reveal a diamond 12 win reward. We're playing the New York Bang. Our opponent has 99 Pudge, Kyle Schwarber, 96 Ian Kinsler, 85 Giambi, Miguel Sano, DD, 83 Kike, Kevin Kiermeyer, Matt Coe on the mound. We got Zach Evelyn on the mound. Away team again. Trying to win again. Be 9-0 with this team. 75% of the way towards 12-0. Reveal that diamond 12 win. Secure the diamond. No, I'm so stupid, man. I let off with Pablo Sandoval instead of Pedro. <gasps> Mike Piazza. Oh, man. <laughs> First, we don't bring in Pedro. 
Then I get a great pitch to hit. And I go and do that with it. That brings up Nico Goodrum, as you guys can see, just getting under that one, man. Shoot. And then I fly out with Nico Goodrum. So I'm getting a little bit under the ball with these two guys. And got on top of it with Panda. Let's see if we can pitch well. Ian Kinsler, a two-out, probably double off the wall. Yeah, that's going to be a double for Ian Kinsler. Two-out double. And striking out Jason Giambi, escaping danger. Man, I'm too nervous right now. I should not be this nervous. I was swinging at pretty much every pitch in the top of the first and just nervous on the mound. Miguel Sano, you're kidding me. I'm down to my final three outs in this game. Miguel Sano extends the game. Two down here in the third inning, guys. That's the tying run. I need to drive him in. Yoan Moncada into the outfield. I wish I would have had a pinch runner. I'm going to send Miguel Sano to third. I'm so stupid, man. I hate myself. I'm so dumb. I just lost that game. I actually lost that game. It always makes me feel at least a little bit better after losing a game to receive a message like this. Yo, sideways, shout out to you, man. I appreciate the love. Hopefully, you enjoy seeing yourself in this video. That's awesome. We're playing the New Mexico Longhorns. Our opponent has 99, Dave Parker, Maggie, Kyle Seeger, 91, Max Muncie, Kike Hernandez, Jorge Blanco, Austin Hayes, Kurt Suzuki, Brandon McKay on the mound. We got Eric Scoglin on the mound. Still trying to get win number nine, game number four here in this video, man. I'm so mad at myself, y'all. I can't believe it. Miguel Sano, first pitch we see in this game. Solo shot, no doubt about it. Where was that from me, man, in the last game? Oh, man. Nico Goodrum had an infield single. Willie McCovey gets it past the first baseman. We got two on, one down. And I'm swinging. This is, what I, this is what I did the last game, too. I'm swinging at every pitch for the most part, man. I'm having trouble taking pitches right now. Dave Parker, first battery face, takes it the other way, leadoff single. Miguel Cabrera flying out for round number one. Kyle Seeger for round number two. And Max Muncy for round number three. Eugenio Suarez with the home run. Kike Hernandez, I thought we jammed him a little bit with the inside pitch, but he's able to take it the other way for hopefully not a triple. Yeah, it's going to be a leadoff double for Kike Hernandez here. Bottom of the second inning, we're winning by two. That brings up Jorge Polanco here. Nobody down. Jorge Polanco flying out for round number one. And what's kind of funny to me, and one of the reasons, like, I love Battle Royale. I would say it's probably my favorite mode, but... The main thing I hate about it is that it's three innings, but I feel like that's one of the things that makes it the most fun. But both of my home runs in this game, I made better contact than that in the last game that I lost on some of my stuff, including the final hit with Miguel Sano, uh, the one that he had like the double on in the third inning to keep the game alive, I think it was, in that last game that we lost. I had better contact and like timing and stuff on that one than I did on his home run in this game. So it's just kind of funny to me. Like, obviously, the pitcher comes into play. It's also a little bit RNG, like, with the result, the pitch location, stuff like that. But uh, that's one of the biggest things is, you know, in three-inning games, sometimes that does happen where maybe you do have some hard-hit balls, but you just you get a little bit unlucky or stuff like that. And it's one of the, the things with me in the three-inning games that I hate the most about it, but then I also have a hard time coming back from right like I give up a home run and then in a three inning game I can't make up for that mistake sometimes and it's one of the reasons I love battle royale but at the same time it's one of the reasons I hate it because a lot of times little mistakes like that where I give up one solo home run will cost me my flawless run like it did right here obviously we would have to you know have won that game and then win the next three to be able to go 12 and 0 but I was undefeated before that and one small mistake on my end ended up losing me the game and Kurt Suzuki up the middle, driving in a run, and we're only winning by one now. We had him chasing the changeup, but he's just able to send it up the middle for a base hit, keeping the inning alive. Adrian Gonzalez pinch hitting, trying to send us to the third inning. And Adrian Gonzalez puts our opponent in the lead. I'm down to my final three ounces with this team. Miguel Sano hit it hard, 109 off the bat, but lining out to the shortstop for out number one. That brings up Mike Piazza, down to my final two ounce now with this team. 
Mike Piazza the other way. There's the tying run. One down. Tying run's going to be on second following that ground rule double. And ball four to Nico Goodrum. A one-out walk, two on, one down. A double play ends the game. We need Willie McCovey to come through. Willie McCovey into the outfield. I doubt it's going to... It is going to drop. Bases are loaded. Vladimir Guerrero, let's go! Oh my goodness, a grand slam! And we take the lead and our... Oh my goodness, we win. Wow. Vladimir Guerrero with the game-winning grand slam. I'm so mad we lost that game. Sideways, like GG's and everything. But oh man, I wish I would have been flawless right now. I really want to be going for 12-0 for you guys. Like, I felt like I've been playing great this Battle Royale run. And I was going to say, I think that's the first game in this run that we've been shut out. Obviously, it is if we've won every game before that. Like, my offense was just nowhere to be found in that game. And as you guys can see, our 12 win diamond reward is 94 Eric Davis. But man, I really wish I was 9 0 right now and not 9 1. Because now, when we go for 12 wins, I could just lose one game and that's the video. And I definitely don't want that to be the case. I'd obviously rather be going for 12 0 versus, you know, 12 wins on its own. But Eric Davis is not a bad 12 win reward. He's probably one of the. Uh, I was going to say one of the better 12 win rewards that you could have. I'm not honestly 100% sure who the 12 win rewards really are, but I definitely feel like he's up there, you know, being at and around between like 25, 40,000 subs. So I feel like he's kind of up there a little bit and I would definitely take that if we can get these next three wins. I'm sorry for choking it for you guys. I'm sorry for losing that game. It happens and it shows that I obviously like, I don't think anyone had any doubt about this, but it shows that I still have things that I can work on to improve here with MLB. If y'all enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment anything down below. Feel free to follow on any of those social media. Sub to the Fortnite channel if y'all want to. I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Peace out.